Um, she really takes care of herself but also other people on the court and helps them figure out where they need to be, especially with younger players, with freshmen and sophomores this year. I've seen her really step up to the challenge of helping them acclimatize to a challenging game. And she definitely takes it as her responsibility if the team's not doing well. No matter who's on that court, whether it's your best players or you got some injuries into your backups, you really need people communicating and people looking out for each other. I didn't know, like, my coach, he just, he's like, oh, you have the hands to be a setter. And then... As an athlete, it's important to respect the coaches, respect the team, respect the opponents, and respect the rules of the game. winning. It's about playing the game that I love. As long as I gave it my all, we work together as a team, it's impossible to walk off the court feeling defeated. This is my fourth year playing volleyball and the position as a setter is often undermined but really it ties the play together. I've improved a lot since freshman year. Like after every game, I would cry, I would be down, like I would just give up after a play that I make a mistake in. But my coach had this phrase called next play. And refocus all your energy, all your focus on the next play, okay? And just ignore what happened, there's nothing you can do about it, but bring everyone back together in the middle and move on. And. Um, a lot of the girls the past years have taken that into their personal lives, so a lot of things happen in their personal lives, and they're able to move on from it. That play has helped me with school and life by just moving on, keeping my head up, staying humble, keep working hard, and like forget about what happened yesterday. Along the way, I realized that I'm a leader and Working as a team is the most important part. Like if one fails, we all fail. If one falls, we all fall. We have to work together in order to.